I'm here with my Seagate 5 terabyte external hard drive and I want to talk about what's going on. Stella, Splash, Simba, Boo, Sammy, Richard, Nancy, Goldie, Ziggy, Ringo, Eva, Hydrox, and Ditto, the Lucky Pharaohs. So this is the hard drive that I've been using for the past year and a half or two years. As you can see, this is labeled Ditto Drive Lucky Ferrells 2022. And that's when I started using this drive. And I go through one of these drives every year or two. And I'll use them until they're full. And then I'll back them up onto a network attached storage system. So I have like an NAS system with five really big hard drives in it. And I'll usually create backups of these external drives. That way I'll have two backups of all of the files that I work on. So whenever I record videos for this channel or edit videos for this channel, all of the information is stored on these external hard drives. And I work off of these external hard drives. And every so often I'll back up the external hard drives onto my larger NAS system. Unfortunately, what has happened because this past year was so crazy, um, especially this past fall with all of the fleas and everything, I did not back up this drive as much as I should have. And the drive has failed. I have been using these Seagate external hard drives for years. I mean, at least 10 years. I've never had one fail on me. And like I said, I usually get a new drive every year or two. Um, so I'm constantly using new drives and I do have a stack of these of like, you know, previous years and everything. And I've never had one fail to the point where I can't access any of the data on it. And I've been trying for almost a week now. I have tried all different cables. It's not a cable issue. I've tried opening this on at least six different computers, some of them Macs, some of them PCs. It will not open on any of them. I can get the computer to recognize it if I go into like system information or if I go and look into um, like the devices, but it will not mount. It will not mount on any of the computers I've tried to mount it on. And that is the issue because I cannot access anything that is on this hard drive. And of course, with the Christmas holiday, it was hard to get in touch with anyone from technical support because that was closed for a while. Today, I was finally able to reach technical support and I found out that this drive is actually still under warranty and it came with a data recovery service warranty also. So thankfully the warranty is still good for data recovery on this drive and through technical support I got a case number and order information and they sent me prepaid mailing labels so I can send this back in. Unfortunately, they can't guarantee 100% that the data will be recoverable. Um, and they also said that it could take up to six weeks to recover the data. Now this disc was almost completely full because we're at the end of the year and it's basically time for me to get a new disc, which I would have been getting either any day now or any week now. It, it was definitely in my mind to do that, but unfortunately, this drive failed before I did that. So where it stands now is today I'm actually going to box this up. I'm going to send it in for data recovery and I'm going to keep my fingers crossed that the majority of the data on this drive can be recovered. This has all of my Final Cut Pro libraries on it because I do all the videos in Final Cut Pro. It has a lot of the completed videos on it. It has tons of screenshots from the videos on it. And more importantly, it has lots and lots of video footage that I have not even put in any videos yet. Like as I take footage on my camera, I dump all the footage onto this hard drive and I don't use all of it. There's a lot of footage that I take that has never been in any of the videos yet. So I've been cranking out weekly vlog videos and before that I was doing the daily vlog videos and what happens is if I sometimes film like a topical video, 
I don't get to it right away and I'll get to it sometimes weeks, months, or even a year or two later. And that's the kind of stuff that's on this hard drive. So I'm really, really hoping that this data gets recovered. And once again, I've been using these Seagate hard drives for a long time. We're talking at least 10 years and I've never had an issue like this with them. They've been really reliable and super easy to use. And this is the first time I've had this issue. And it's also a really good lesson for me to remember to back up these drives on a much more regular basis. I was just kind of backing them up a few times a year, but I really need to start backing them up either on a, like a weekly basis or definitely on a monthly basis. So if that was the case, I would have only lost a few weeks worth of footage versus potentially half a year of footage, if not maybe even more. I just checked my network back up today and it looks like I have all of season six backed up, but I don't have anything from season seven backed up. And I started season seven this past September. So that would make sense because when I started the season, it was with like all of the craziness with the fleas going on and I had absolutely no time to do anything. But unfortunately, I didn't back up all of the other footage that was on here um, that has not been used in any videos yet. So I just wanted to explain that. So if videos start becoming a little delayed on this channel, that's why. Also, what is going to happen is I'm probably going to have to recreate a lot of what I have from scratch. I'm going to try to salvage what I can as far as like the intro to the vlogs and the ending to the vlogs and like the titles and stuff. But I might have to spend a lot of time recreating certain elements that I use in the videos, which is very time consuming. Yeah, I'm just going to have to take it like one day at a time and see what I could do. So if the videos on this channel start looking a little different, that's why it's because I don't have um, the tools that are saved on this drive and I can't find them in my backups and I'm just going to have to like recreate things. So I just wanted to film this to let you know uh, what's been going on. I'm still working on getting the Christmas video posted and I have to see like where we stand with like what I have saved on my camera. Um, hopefully I have at least a week or two of footage saved on my camera that I had not dumped on here yet. But that's the situation. Um, this is a major, major setback. I mean, the quicker they can recover data off of this drive, the better. And the more data they can recover off of this drive, the better. But I might not get any data back. And I and if I do get data back, it could sometimes take up to six weeks. So I just wanted to let you guys know that if there's some unexpected delays with content on this channel, this is why we're dealing with like, this is like the biggest data issue I've had ever. So I just wanted to let you know about it. Thanks so much for watching the videos on this channel. Thanks so much for the support. We hope you've been having a wonderful holiday season and look for more videos coming soon. But if things are a little bit delayed, now you know why. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Bye.